everyone, I'm going to share with you how to make an ornament, a coaster. So um, I'm going to make the, um, the it's good enough size for the cup, coffee cup. You can make this for the gift, everyone. Just make like four or six, it depends on how many people in the family. And then you put it in a box and give it to the uh, person for Christmas. That would be awesome. I'm going to share with you how to make the circle. Just in case I have the thing for the circle, but I just want to show you how to do this. So I'm going to fold the paper, any size, any paper you want. And then I want to make it the four and a half inch coaster. So after fold it four side, and this is the two fold and big fold on this side, I'm gonna go around and mark in two inch and a quarter because I want it the four and a half inch. So half of it, two and a quarter. All right, so now go ahead and cut that out. Get another piece of paper. This is uh, the same place that I'm going to share with you in my description. So place it in here. Trace it in here. That is the circle of this four and a half inch. You need to mark the center so you know exactly from the side to side two in together like that from one side to the other and I mark like this this way that the one inch here like right in the middle like that okay so then from each side here you're going to go up half an inch going up half an inch and this side going up half an inch and there you have a template you also need to cut another piece That's the template for the ornament. And then you're going to cut another piece of one and a half inch wide. Okay. And this side is three inches. I do it three inches long. After you cut in this out, you're going to cut this like this, everyone. I also cut this one right here I cut two of this okay two fabric and then this one right here I cut the five and half inch of fabric and five and half inch of the bedding and this one I have here it doesn't um, do allow me to iron on so I got to sold it so let's just do it on this side I place it in here first hand sew or machine sew is the same this person asking me to share how to do hand sew so um, before I do the permanent sew I'm gonna go ahead and uh, because if you have the glue here you can iron and make it stay here it easier but I don't have that I have this one so you have to go ahead and do bait instead And then from here, I just want to make it easier. I don't have to go another line down. So I'm going to go this way to like a triangle down. I just want to make sure it's staying down for me. That's all I really want. To make it easier because if you want to, to do that for sale, it's going to sell really good too. Quick, easy and um, make sure you buy the one that you can iron on just to save your time and now from this side i'm gonna go up like this so that's why i have the one in the middle too very simple go ahead and do this all so i'm gonna go on this side right here i'm gonna go all the way on the top Going down.
and then you go on to draw this line. This is for the beginner. Okay. So this line, so this line, and so this line. So it's like this everyone. So you're gonna sew this side to this line all the way and then go up to here the same way like this. So after I sewed it in here everyone, so go ahead and inside out. You're gonna hold this way and then you're gonna hold this corner and then you inside out this way. And on this side, you're gonna do the same thing. Gonna fold this way, this way, and then fold, take this out. It's much easier. When I got the request, and people were asking me to share how to do this for elderly. I'm like, oh my goodness, I'll do it right away. Oh, not them, not elderly. So after this, you're gonna bring this back in here. This is the one that with the baby. And I'm going to go ahead and cut it down. Put this down and then turn into the right side if it's right here place this one right on it you turn to this side you see this line right here you go ahead and sew the straight line you see this line right here I'm gonna sew on this line So everyone, after I sew on the red one in here, this is the right side. You go ahead and put another piece. This is the other side of this. You're gonna place it on it. Super easy. Then on the top here, you go ahead and sew this line. Sew it on this line. And then sew it all around here. Go all around here and then sew it in here. You can go in. A little bit in here too and so so you see in this one the like three go close to it I wish I have more time to go to the senior center and start doing things with them. That would be the best. So I'm coming to here where I start and when I saw the light earlier and then from here go ahead and go all around the circle and come to here. Remember when this thing right here, you're going to make sure you sold it down too. So that's why I asked you to go in a little bit. Like in a little bit will be higher the line that you cut. So that way it can stay together. All right, everyone. So go ahead and do that hand sew. Get this out so it won't tangle my thing. So go ahead and sew. Do back stitch, running stitch, or whatever stitch you decide to do. As long as you stitch it all around. 
so relaxing. So like that everyone. So the same way I show you right here go all around. Okay, so everyone as you can see I have so remember this one right here you go on to sew it in a little bit right there where we don't sew it here, okay? But go in a little bit, go in about one eighth up and ends right here, and then from there you're gonna go all around and then coming in a little bit mean one eighth up an inch. And now I'm gonna take this bait and stitch off the middle line only okay and then from there you can use pink and shear to cut or around or the other day when I use pink and shear to cut and then so many people say I don't have it so my heart broke I feel sad okay so now I'm gonna go ahead and cut this around with the line that I sew If you don't want to cut it close like that, you can do this too. You can. Okay, I'll show you. So go ahead and cut this. Make sure you don't cut on the sole line. That's out of my hand. I can't do anything if you do. All right. inside out is right here between the red and the green you'll be able to do that take a deep breath inhale its health and pull this down You want to make an ornament before you sew this from the beginning you fold this together fold it this and then ask the um, the string fold the string and add it in here and then sew the exact the same look at that how beautiful I have two ribbon here that I got it from a Dollar Tree you can go get many of them there so I gotta fold overlap one inch each go right into the center Look how beautiful it is everyone so you don't want to see the thread you can get the button and glue it in there I have something like this that I purchased online for my hair bow I'm gonna use the glue and add it in just to dress up a little bit here so cute get a whole bunch and give it to um, the kid to do that to everyone they can use fail fabric if they want to. And this one you can wash it. Adorable on both sides. 
so beautiful you put a cup in here how cute that is that. everyone and it's super easy to do too so cute and it's two sides to you this side too you want to use this side you can you use the other side you can too both sides are perfect look at that and then you can put the cup in there perfect it fit like that I love it so cute I love it. I love how beautiful it is. Look at that, everyone. So pretty. Stay safe and take care, everyone. Thank you so much for watching. Please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And also, click on the uh, subscribe button to say to turn on the notification. So every time I upload a video, you will never miss any of them.